In order to provide a solution to the waste management problem at hospitals, the company Matachana has developed a solution which consists of an infectious waste integral system, IWIS. The system is comprised of a small comprehensive treatment plant integrated into a 20-foot maritime container with all of the equipment required for covering the needs of the process. It may be installed outside the centre, occupying a space of approximately two parking spots and only requires one electrical connection, one water connection and drains. Once the special biocontaminated waste has been properly classified, suitable containers are used to transport the waste to the EWIS that is located outside the building. Ramps are used to access the inside of the containers with the waste. If the steriliser is executing a cycle at that moment, the container, the one used for transporting the waste and which has the bags inside it, is stored inside the refrigerator, with the lid open and at a temperature of 4 degrees Celsius. This refrigerator has the capacity to store two 240 litre containers. Once sufficient load is available to start a cycle, the steriliser is loaded with the autoclave bags, removing the seals from the bags. These bags resist a temperature greater than 134 degrees Celsius. For safety reasons, it is essential for the operator to be equipped with the proper personal protective equipment while carrying out tasks inside the EWIS. Consequently, the steriliser door is closed and a cycle is started, during which the condensers, as well as the air, are treated in order to not injure the operator or damage the environment. Once the cycle is complete and the treated waste is unloaded, the next step is started, which consists of shredding the waste in a manner that is completely safe for the operator since the waste is sterile. This shredding, in conjunction with the sterilisation, considerably reduces the amount of waste and also changes its appearance, making it unrecognisable, thus preventing any possible reuse of the waste. The result of the entire process is a final waste that is similar to urban waste. Worth mentioning is that the container includes a physical separation between the working areas and the technical area, which is where the maintenance of the equipment is carried out. Also, these areas have completely different accesses. The container also includes a CSC plate, which makes it suitable for maritime transport. This way, it can be shipped to any part of the world without needing to be loaded inside a bay.